Welcome back to Mega Man X Command Mission. We are fighting Psyche's true form. First, let's get some data on him. Mad Nautilus. You can steal a cure-all and a tractor net from him. Tractor nets are really hard to get later on in the game, but, like, I had some on my original file, but I never actually used them because, like, they just never seemed very good to me. And he drops a sub-tank and a virus missile. So anyway... I want to show you something first. Okay, so... You think you could just attack him like any other boss, right? Well, most beginners, well, usually just put their hyper modes up and just nail a boss regardless of whether they're fighting. Like, I'm gonna show you. Well, that doesn't count as I never actually hit him. Basically, Psyche will counter any and every move you use on him. And it does a lot. Basically, he has a weak point. So, what should you do until his weak point is exposed? Defend, as it'll make his attacks less painful, and... Ugh. Yeah, like, this guy's attacks do a lot. But behind a defense, they aren't much stronger than any regular attack. Thanks, X Heart. Okay, so now that he's revealed his core. Ah, oh, I used the wrong thing. Marino's hyper mode is a fun one. Why? Now the real fun starts. It might not exactly do. What? Guess she's not that fast as I remember it constantly giving consecutive turns. I'm gonna have Spider heal the team. I mean, yeah, Marino's on is going not very bad, but everybody else could use a healing. Like, it's a real advantage because, oh. Death Gravity. It has health if it hits. Anyway... I'm gonna have X cool down as... Hyper Mode, like... Honestly... Like, you only want them up if you're going for an offensive on him. And it's not a very good idea to do that until... Like, I have beat this guy before by just attacking, but... It was really hard. Like, I just barely beat him. I'm happy I have the fence set to my Z button. Because basically, it means that I want to go to the menu and pick it. Yeah, well, also, Mad Estesy is the only attack in the game that can actually target two characters. Let's put on Charge Collider. It's probably gonna miss, but if it hits, 
It's gonna devastate. Meh. Not a lot of damage, but it's still pretty good. Time for a fight. I guess I could put Spider's Hyper up simply because it's a really useful Hyper. Whoa! He's almost done? Hmm. I'll put Quicksilver on? And I guess that's... The only hyper I'm gonna need. Provided that happens. Let's go for an action trigger. I want hyper dive. Come on! Yes! I love how I've, how I've actually successfully pulled it off so much yet. That was a weak move. I'm gonna cool down as, like, in case it wasn't obvious enough, like, Psyche is on his last legs, like, there's not much more he can do to us. Spider can keep attacking. Because he's safe behind his hyper. Of course it misses. Did he still fuss off a counter? Jeez. That move can randomly put status effects on you. But it's instantly gonna fail if you have any characters in Hyper, or... any characters that are blocking. And he opens his weak spot. Yeah, he killed Marino. But I'm not worried as, like, this should finish him off. And so he blows up. Like a good robot. Aw, so we don't get a bonus. Which is really stupid considering... Good card. So we get our sub tank and virus missile. Oh, Marno didn't gain any XP from the fight. Meh. Professor. And here's the last cutscene for this chapter. You rescued my dear cinnamon, but I won't cooperate. Not with the rebellion army, and not with you. The force metal generator, Cinnamon, must not be used to wage war. But, but... Professor, I want to fight with X. What? Cinnamon, what's gotten into you? I... I'm not being used. <laughs> this is my own idea. We can't let people like Psyche and the Rebellion Army get away with this. Even though Psyche was a really, well, no, like, honestly, he's a good beginner's trap, but once you discover a secret, his second form is no problem. What's the verdict, Professor? Well, lad. Ha, uh, he said lad. After all, Dr. Psyche was a wonderful mind. The Rebellion Army destroyed him. We can't allow that to continue. Thank you, Professor Godil. Looks like we have a new ally. Woo! A new ally? Don't you mean two? Marino! You're going to fight with us, Marino? But a thief like me? Your past doesn't matter. I knew you had a good heart. That's <laughs> why I let you kidnap me. Oh, shucks. <laughs> Welcome on board, yeah. So anyway, we get Marino and Cinnamon as permanent members of the team. 
And we can now use the force metal generator. Basically, you need force metal energy and ingredients to get. Like, force metal energy is generated during final strikes and when you beat enemies, like, and force, like, basically, you can make force metals with ingredients. Some force metals can't be made, like, I honestly never really bothered with it. And we are really coming up on the time limit, so I'll save my game and see you guys later. Goodbye.